the face decoration template comes with two main things. We have this delete me block here, which is actually just the glasses here. Let's rename that back to glasses. It's a little confusing. And then down here we have a face occluder and a head occluder. Now what occluders do is occlude objects. And if you don't know what that means, it's basically overlapping. So if something occludes something else, it's overlapping. So when these are selected, you can see the blue outline of this. And as I move the camera around, the glasses disappear. So you can see the glasses here appear as the occluder is behind it. And so how does this work? Let's select the face and check out this material. So it's a standard material, but the alpha is set to zero. If we increase this, we can see both the face and the head. And you can see the same idea happening. The glasses disappear because that face is in front of it, obviously. But when the alpha is set to zero, it still calculates this. But because alpha is zero, it's transparent. And so it occludes this. And then the glasses themselves are right on the nose. And the way that's calculated is this parent null has its position set to use the nose. So down here we have these three patches, which basically grab the face location. And then pulling this out, we can get nose information. And this is tied to the bridge of the nose. So this little area here is the bridge of the nose. And so these glasses are tied to that. So you can move the glasses independently here, and they'll stay relatively stuck to the bridge of the nose, but now their translation is moved. So you can see over here, if we reset this Y, then that looks like it's right back on track. And then down here we have mouth open, multiplied by 0.1 to make it smaller, and then packed in here, and then it's subtracted from these kind of arbitrary values and put into the scale of the head occluder. So the head occluder is just this shape here. So if I open my mouth, you can see this just gets a little bit smaller. And I believe the reason they built it this way is maybe with your jaw opening, the temples go in a little bit on your face. I mean, it's kind of hard to see in the video, but I imagine if you have your mouth open, you don't want this to clip through, and so the head shape gets a little bit smaller. If we delete all this, it still works pretty much the same, but it looks like you can see it's clipping here already because the scale is different. You can see as we scale it in and out, it occludes here differently, so it clips here a little early. So you don't want that to be too big. Ideally, it's a perfect fit on a face. So yeah, that's occlusion and some sweet shades.